guys welcome back to my channel so for today's video we have another princess poly haul which is always one of my favorites because i absolutely love everything on their site like i could literally scroll for days but what i've been doing recently with these hauls is styling all these outfits into actual like wearable looks i'm not just showing you the pieces on i'm showing you how you can wear it how you can layer it how you can make it a cute look um so it's almost like a styling video so i think it's really fun i have a lot of fun putting these together i know you guys enjoy them too so today we're kind of tackling basics i have a lot of staple items here a lot of just like basic tank tops basic dresses a lot of things you can wear in different ways um which is something that i love um but just a few things i want to mention before we get into the video i do have a coupon code with them so if there's anything you guys see in this video that you want um you could just use the code jamie x20 for 20 percent off everything on princess poly they do offer free two-day shipping on us orders over 50 which is great because they get here so quickly um and they do offer afterpay if you guys are interested in that my sizing will be linked in the description box below if you guys want to check it out i know the sizing can be kind of tricky if you've never shopped there before so if you guys want to check that out for reference that will be in there um but without further ado let's go ahead and get into this video okay let's start off with what i'm wearing now i have this amazing just something that i want to wear all summer long this is like my ideal summer outfit because it's cool it's chic it's cute but it's also lightweight comfortable and airy and perfect for hot weather um and just you know it's a no-brainer you could just put it on and it's cute so i have this amazing t-shirt dress that is actually like a dress on me a lot of the t-shirt dresses are really really short because i am i'm five seven i'm not like super tall i guess probably taller than average but i still have a hard time finding t-shirt dresses that look like dresses on me i think maybe because they have kind of longer legs that always just everything looks so short but this is perfection it has that total boyfriend t-shirt um oversized look not like anything where it looks like it's trying to be a dress it kind of just has that cool street style vibe which i absolutely love it's kind of what i go for i kind of want to look like i'm wearing like a vintage t-shirt that i found at a thrift store or something like that um so this is that perfect vibe it even has that like burnout texture which i love you guys always hear me talk about that i love things that are a little bit faded and look a little bit worn out you guys will definitely be seeing this a lot also forgot i wanted to mention these two items before we got into anything else um two things you're gonna see with basically all these looks is this bag and these little shoulder bags have kind of become a theme in my princess poly videos my last one i had this gray croc one that i absolutely love and i i've been wearing that so much and i just felt like a black was so necessary because it goes with so many things as you'll see in this video i'm pretty sure i wear it with every single outfit um and i just i love it so much i even have all my stuff in here i've been carrying it um this whole past weekend i've been wearing it all weekend long so i've already gotten compliments on it it's like that super cool 90s kind of nostalgic vibe kind of takes everything to the next level of like being a little bit more trendy and cool um um, while still being simple and you know not doing too much which i love so this bag is great um and then the second thing that i wanted to mention are these earrings i have these hoops that you'll see with a lot of these outfits too these are also from princess polly of course you cannot go wrong with a good pair of hoops i saw these and just thought they were a perfect staple i don't typically wear the thin hoops anymore i always do this kind of thicker style it's just a little bit um you know it's a little bit more the vibe right now i don't really know how to describe it it's more on trend um and this size is really great and it just will look good with so many different things it's the perfect addition to your outfit which you will see with all of these looks today let's get into the next piece that you're also going to be seeing a lot and that is this plaid shirt and this i actually wore last week um and i posted it on my story and i did get a lot of questions about it and i told you guys i'm talking a lot about basics in this video obviously patterns would be something i'd stay away from when i'm talking about basics but items like this just like very neutral colors this is almost like a basic to me you can wear with so many different things it's just that perfect third piece to your outfit it goes great with the basic so i wanted something like this that we can kind of add a little bit of flavor to um but i still definitely do consider this like a basic item uh, because you can throw it over pretty much anything as long as it you know the colors match but honestly you'll see with a few different things today you could even throw it over like a graphic tee or just anything like that it's great and what i love about it is that it's perfect for summer i love layering and doing cool outfits like obviously you guys are going to be seeing today but it's a little hot in the summer to be doing all that so this is nice and thin so it's perfect for that summertime kind 
kind of vibe um, where you're not doing too much and like overheating with your layering. <laughs> this is super light and easy to throw over pretty much anything. You guys are gonna see this a few different ways in this video. I'm sorry if it's overkill, but I absolutely love this. Um, it's so, so cute. I love the colors and the oversized like boyfriend fits, very boxy and trendy. It looks like it could be a men's shirt, which I've established I love. Um, so yeah, let's get into how I style this. So there's a few pieces that I paired this with that I got from Princess Polly as well. But the first one that I wanted to share is with this little tank dress. And this is something that I feel like you guys are gonna go crazy for because it's just so basic and easy to throw on while still being cute. Again, a really easy and effortless piece to throw on in the summertime. Something you could layer with, you can wear it out, you can wear it during the day. You definitely could do it with sneakers or you could dress it up. Um, it's just one of those versatile, amazing pieces. And I got this tan color um, just cause again, I think this is great for summertime. It's very neutral while still being like, you know, a little bit more on trend for the season. Would look really great with a tan or a deeper skin tone. I just think this is gorgeous. And it happened to pair perfectly with that plaid shirt. And it looks super cute with a pair of sneakers. And I put my hair back. It made the hoop stand out a little bit more and it just kind of added to the vibe. I really, really liked it. Um, so that is one way that I would style this. Like I said, you could definitely do it in a bunch of different ways. It's just one of those pieces that you can do so much with. Um, so I really love this color, but I also got one more color. And this one, again, no brainer. Like look at the color, the gray is obviously the vibe. So this one I love too. It's the same exact dress in gray. They do have a few more colors. So definitely go check them out if you guys are interested because I feel like they're going to be a really hot item. But you guys are kind of seeing, you guys are kind of seeing how you can add a little bit more to a basic dress like this. Obviously it looks really cute just to wear it with some sneakers, just plain. But I do love to dress things like this up a little bit more just to make it a little bit different, a little bit funner. Um, it's great on its own, but it's also great to layer with a plaid shirt like I just showed. Um, but also this one, I did like a satin, what was supposed to be kind of a dress, but it's a little bit short on me, um, a satin button down that I also got from Princess Polly. I do believe they still have it. I've shared it on my channel so many times, but I'm gonna link it below for you guys. Um, it looks so cool with that, with a pair of sneakers, and it's just such a vibe. So I really, really like this outfit. Um, and just kind of gives you guys an example of how you can turn this into a full look that makes a little bit more of a statement than just wearing the plain dress. But also the plain dress is just everything too. I love the cut on this. It's obviously that ribbed stretchy material that is just so comfortable. I would probably size up at least one size in these um, just cause they are a little bit short. Um, if you're worried about that, just size up. If not, you don't really care about it being short. That's fine too. Um, but just a little fair warning on that. They're really, really cute though. And so, so comfortable. So next up we have a few little crop tops, a few little basic crops, um, just things that I've been loving right now because you know, we're home a lot more. Our outfits are really casual. Um, so I've been really into wearing crops like this with sweat shorts or sweats or leggings or just so many different things it's just really easy to throw on so this color I'm really into right now it's more of like an off-white cream kind of color it's super cropped nice like boxy cut on it and I really really love it it is like a muscle tank kind of style um, and it's ribbed and stretchy I just styled it with a cute little pair of boyfriend shorts and some sandals um, and then I threw my hair back it kind of has that like 90s vibe especially with the um, little shoulder bag that I've been talking about I feel like it has a very nostalgic look to it um, just very you know 90s like I said I feel like I'm always referring to the 90s but they're back they've been back and it's just such a vibe so I'm really into this outfit very easy simple summer outfit to throw on so really love that and then I have one more that looks kind of similar but it is a different tank top I almost thought that they were the same when I was ordering them but the cuts are completely different um, and this one is a little bit longer so this one is in white it's ribbed just like the other one but it's more of a loose material not as fitted um, and it's a little bit longer so if you guys didn't want something so cropped this is not as cropped as that one before so this one I love and I styled it with these adorable pair of sweatshorts that I just got um, that I have been looking for for summertime because like I said we've been home a lot sorry let me find them we've been home a lot more obviously and I was wearing sweats these last few months so often and then all of a sudden it's just like 90 degrees every single day that's how it happens in California it's just like nice and cool and, and then it's just like straight into summertime so the sweats aren't really working right now I knew I wanted a pair of sweat shorts because I still wanted to have that kind of vibe um, and I found these and I thought these were so great they're so comfortable so cute they kind of ride that line of being cozy and cute for a home but also something you could wear out which is what I love I love dressing things up like this you can wear it with a pair of sneakers um, I wore it with some slides and it looked really cute too um, but you definitely could do other things with this oh I actually do have an outfit with sneakers with this so you 
you guys will see that next but these are so so adorable i do believe they have a matching sweatshirt which would be really really cute um to do a little set i definitely would wear that out with sneakers too so nice material they're rolled on the ends and I just love them. I really, really love this outfit. I actually wore it last week. I took some pictures in it that I'll be posting when this video goes up. So that's kind of a good example of a third piece, um, which I am showing a lot in this video, um, how you can layer basics and add just that third statement piece that takes your outfit to the next level. Um, so it's not just so simple. Um, it's a way that you can wear your clothes a ton of different ways and get the most use out of them. That is one of my favorite outfits for sure. But next up, I have those same shorts on, but then I'm wearing this bodysuit with it so we have a lot of like ribbed material today i don't really know what that's about i wasn't really thinking about that but almost everything in this video is this ribbed texture i don't know i'm into it i guess so this bodysuit i love i love the lining right here the seam it's so cool just the color is so trendy and it just kind of reminds me of like yeezy kardashian that kind of vibe i feel like it's a color scheme they wear often it's like you know they always do bodysuits too so it really reminded me of them and i feel like in true kardashian yeezy fashion wear them with some sweats but it's summer so i'm doing sweat shorts instead um, but it would look really really cute with a pair of sweats just like some black sweats and some sneakers or you could do high-waisted jeans if you want to even like a little leather skirt if you're going out um, that would be really really cute too but I basically just switched out the crop top from the last outfit for this bodysuit and then I added a pair of sneakers to kind of switch it up a little bit and I really really love how this looks so this one is really cute it's very comfortable too which is a plus okay my next little crop top is something really fitted and something really cute so this is another ribbed piece like wow I don't know what's happening um but this I love so much because it has that like super muscle tank kind of cut right here I'll show a little side boob if you're into that um but you could also cover it up like I'm going to show you today it looks really cute with this sleeveless flannel and these jeans I just really love this look this is a perfect example of layering basics because this is the piece you just start with and you can wear it with so many different pieces in your closet you could do sweats like I said you could do leggings you could do jeans you could do shorts like you could wear this with basically anything and throw anything over um, and again it's one of those things you don't need a bra with I am just wearing some nipple covers because I didn't want it to be you know completely see-through um, so I would definitely do that if you guys pick this up um, but it is so cute and just a very easy piece to have um, that I will get a lot of use out of for sure would look really cute with biker shorts too and you could even just do a jacket over or something if you guys don't want to wear it sleeveless um, but the cut on it is really really cute and it looked really good on the girl on the website too it's kind of what inspired me she looked she was wearing it with jeans and it just looked like everything so and again this is that kind of cream color it's not as dark as the other piece that I showed you but it's kind of like an off-white kind of color not a true white almost like a bone color would we say eggshell eggshell that's the color <laughs> okay next up is my last crop top for this video and I do want to mention if you don't typically love crop tops I'm not someone that just like wears a crop top with like low-rise pants or like shorts and shows my whole stomach that is not the vibe I just usually show like a little bit of my midsection I always am wearing super high-waisted bottoms whether that's a skirt shorts jeans whatever um you can kind of see it's done a little bit more modestly it doesn't have to be like fully cropped and showing your whole stomach. If you guys aren't into something like that, that's totally fine. I would just size up in these pieces so they're not super short, but definitely wear them with high-waisted bottoms so that you're not fully exposed because, you know, that's not really my vibe either. Um, but I do like showing just like a little bit of my midsection. I think it looks um, flattering on my body type to wear high-waisted with a little tiny slight crop. So this I've actually been eyeing on Princess Polly for a while now. They have always been sold out on my size every time I check for it. It's just one of those staple basics that they always have on their site and the girl just looks so cute wearing it on the website she just has some jeans on with it and some sunglasses and it looks so stylish and cool um such a simple outfit but just always cute you know just you can't go wrong so i love this it's just a basic ribbed <laughs> cropped short sleeve black tee crop top situation well it's the longest explanation for something this simple but i kind of decided to dress it up a little bit more in this video so i originally was going to wear it with like my sweat shorts and like a baseball cap and some sneakers kind of show you guys a really casual vibe with it um but i do want to show you how pieces like this can go a long way in your closet and you can dress it up a little bit more um so i dressed it up but it's not like fancy or anything but it's a step above the very casual outfits I'm showing you today um, and I do think it looks really cute with this blue shirt and my black jeans I love doing like full black with something colored over I think that looks really really cute whether it's a cropped black t-shirt and then a black biker shorts and then a flannel or just anything like a black skirt black shirt something over um, and in this situation the black jeans with a black crop and then something over as like a statement piece so you keep the base very simple 
simple, but then add something to take it to the next level. That's something that I kind of do a lot. I've actually, I'll pop a few pictures up on the screen for my Instagram of things that I've done. I feel like that's kind of a formula that I keep for a lot of my clothes and it works really well for me. I always think it looks cute um, and it just doesn't look like you're trying too hard, you know, so. And the hoops and my bag just kind of took it to that next level to make it even more trendy and cool and it completed the full outfit. So I really, really liked that one. Um, and this crop is just gonna, you know, be really helpful in a lot of different outfits. Okay, ending this video on the finale, drum roll please. We have this dress that is basically just like popping off right now on Princess Polly. It's this cinched dress that I'm seeing everywhere right now. They have so many different colors and I am obsessed. So I decided to do something different for myself and get this like camel color. This is something I would not normally do, but I do think this is really gorgeous for summertime because it will look really good with a tan and it'll just be like so bronzed and pretty and I'm just really into it. I don't know when I'm gonna wear it, but I'm loving it. So I love these dresses. They have pastel colors, they have black, they have white. They just have so many different options for whatever kind of style you have. And I think it's a really flattering dress, but it's definitely a dress you feel so cute in. Um, what I love about it is that the cinch on the side is adjustable so you can make it as short or as long as you want it to be Undone this dress actually can look really long like I'm not going to show you guys in this video But it literally can go like to my knees So the cinch is really just to fit whatever kind of preference you have um, I cinched it a decent amount because I want it to be a little bit shorter I was seeing this all over Instagram and I'm so glad that I got my hands on it I am just obsessed with this and I cannot wait to have a reason to wear it Even if it's just to shoot some pictures in my house which I'm here for so yeah that is the last piece for this video and that brings us to the end I'm so sorry it's over I'm sad I feel like I've been filming this all day and it's just finally coming to a close um, but it was really fun and I hope you guys enjoyed it please let me know what your favorite item was in this video I'd love to hear from you guys if you guys are interested in anything in this video just check out the description box um, my sizing will be in there like I said and I think that's pretty much it make sure you guys subscribe before you go I'd love to have you here follow me on Instagram um, I don't know what this is but I will see you guys in my next one. My next one's going to be a vlog, by the way. Um, I just keep talking, so sorry. But I love you guys. I will see you later in my next one. Bye.